Good morning, everyone. This is Sunday in the wee hours of the morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for your continued support. You know I'm trying to reach 10,000 subscribers before or on uh, in June 2020. Okay, so let's keep the ball rolling, keep subscribing to me, keep subscribing to me. I'm just like that little engine that's uh, trying to make it, trying to make it, trying to make it. And then I'm going to choo, 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 and be a steamroller for us over with. So help me get to that point. Watch all my videos, as I said in previous videos. Subscribe and share my videos. And like, 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 subscribe, 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 like, 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 subscribe, 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 Okay. Um, we're going to get into this story, uh, quick, fast, and in a hurry. We get it from Atlanta Black Star. Uh, we have the journalist by the name of Tia Berger flashing it out, throwing it out for us to review, take hints, take notes, and then talk about it, okay? Um, she's giving us a title of Five Ways NeNe Leaks Earns Her Millions, okay? We already know it's for the Housewives of Atlanta, it's from her major contributor is the Housewives of Atlanta. She's using her platform very well. But let's get on into this article so we can see what other strides she has made to claim her fame or fortune. And she lives, she definitely is solidifying herself in the entertainment world as we know it. Okay, the title of her article again, to your burger over at Atlanta Black Star. Uh, five ways Nene Leaks earns her million. Okay, and it ain't on no stripper pole. It ain't stripper for them dollars. Let the men holler. Okay, I tried to do a little rap, but y'all know how it go. <laughs> it's all entertainment. All right. Uh, television personality Nene Leaks is steadily expanding her empire and cashing in those checks. Remember, she's definitely cashed in a Trump check back in the day. Okay, when she was on Celebrity Apprentice. The celebrity edition. If you didn't catch it, I'm sure it's somewhere out there on YouTube world. Look for it. Okay, it's so, uh, not in a, not in her article. I just put that on the sidebar. From writing books to owning her own boutique, the 51 year old star is racking up the dough. I say do re me money. Okay, but uh, T in her article said dough. Here are five ways leaks generates income. Let's get into it, people. Number one, Nene Leaks owns a clothing boutique. Leaks launched her clothing store swag boutique on May 21st at MGM National Harbor in Maryland. She also owns two other locations, which is in Duluth, Georgia and Miami, Florida. All right. She apparently served as the interior decorator and designer of her boutiques, according to an Instagram post. She shared on May 19th, okay? Definitely, Nene is tooting her own horn and dropping receipts as she go along, okay? And if you go on her Instagram page, as well as Marlo Hampton's, they, you will see some uh, cute little uh, photos of them enjoying the uh, fruits of their labor, as Nene likes to say, okay? Um, number two, Nene Leaks is a spokesperson for hair for a hair company called Color Main Wigs, okay? Woo! We know she liked the blonde wigs, but if she could get back to a little darker color, it would have surely appreciate. I would appreciate it, but hey, I ain't on her head. I ain't trying to uh, tell her how to do her thing. It's just a suggestion. She could take it or leave it. It just is what it is, because Nene going to wear that blonde hair until the day she die. I'm pretty sure on that one. Just saying, give us a little something other than the blonde. But if that's the way, that's your true color to fame, that's who you're going to pretend to be, even though I think you're trying to mimic Kim Zosiac, but that's just me and how I feel. But go on and do you, girl, like you're going to do every day, all day. Okay, you ain't going to pay me no mind. You're going to put me in the dust. You're going to put me out there in the desert somewhere, okay, where you think I should be, more than likely. Some of your fans may feel that way, okay? All right. But getting back to the number two uh, position, Nene Holes is acquiring all of her dollars her wealth okay her lucrative deals number two she is a spokesperson for a haircut company called color main wigs in october 1st the real housewives but lamb star announced she was the spokesperson for color main wigs the job consists of her modeling different hair pieces for the company including her infamous blonde wigs okay i just got finished talking about that blonde Woo. 
I don't know. She, I guess she's uh, true to fine when they said blondes have more fun. But we all know that's a lie. I don't care what color hair you got. If you want to have fun, you're going to have fun. If you want to shine from the ship. Swing from the chandeliers where you're kind of probably intoxicated. It's okay. Because it's your house, I'm sure, I'm hoping, if you bring down a ceiling, hey, it's on you. You got the money to repair it. Moving on. Okay. Uh, the third way a Nene Leakes acquires her money is through, she does stand-up comedy. Now, Nene, she took us the hell out of me. But it ain't because she said a joke. It's just how she's getting down with her co co-workers, her colleagues, okay? I never thought Nene was really personally funny, but then I haven't sat in on one of her sets. So y'all had to get in the comments and tell me, have y'all ever been to one of Nene's stand-up comedy review shows with the other ladies? Or what y'all think about it, pretty much? Because I, I really don't have no thoughts on it. I don't see her as someone that's going to sit up there that I'm going to pay money for, that she's going to tell me a joke from the time she get on stage to the time she leave, And I'm going to be uh, busting in stitches, meaning my stomach, and the laughter that she's supposedly going to give me. I think she's probably like Tiffany Haddish, thinking she could, you know, just because she's funny in certain circumstances or some environments don't make she gonna get up on that stage and make everybody kiki ha ha laugh laugh no okay but anyway uh it says she does stand up comedy for number three the supposed queen of shade took her talents on stage and began doing stand up comedy shows around 2016 in early february she hosted the countrywide latest night out comedy tour with which featured Adele Gibbons, Lonnie Love, Sherry Shepard, Kim Whitley, and more. Now, I do know Sherry Shepard, she, you know, has been in the entertainment um, field for a long time, as well as Kim Whitley and Adele. But again, we have to uh, read very carefully when it states that Ladies Night Out comedy tour, it said uh, she hosted. So hosting is a very different thing then going on stage and bringing the acts out to perform for you and make you laugh, okay? So, see what I'm saying? They're trying to put the two as, a, uh, what do you call it, as simoniously, like they're going harmony with one another. No, 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 no. Nene was hosting, okay? She was not there trying to make people laugh, laugh, okay? We do remember that Uber driver, and she had said that she hoped they get what? Okay, moving on, uh, number four. It says, uh, Nene Leakes stars on Real Housewives of Atlanta. We all know that. Uh, Leakes became a breakout star on Real Housewives of Atlanta in 2008 and was given the name Shady Boots by viewers. Uh, she left the Bravo reality show in 2015 and rejoined the cast in 2017. Yes, Nene went out for a little several ventures or whatever, thinking she going to make more money than being on Real Housewives of Atlanta. But she learned quick, fast, and her how television and sitcoms get down. And if you're not a part of that ratings and bring it in the ratings, uh, it's more crucial and deadly when you were in the sitcom show versus the reality show that she definitely stars in. So, like I said, she had to get with Cynthia. Cynthia brought her back in as a friend coming back in. And before you know it, Nene Leakes, once that door opened for her, she was going to come and take names. Okay, she didn't care who she had to step on to get back as queendom of the Real Housewives of Atlanta, okay? So she had to do a lot of damage control to get her seat back. And she solidified, and she ain't going nowhere. You can't even think about giving her an offer if she's going to have to leave Real Housewives of Atlanta again. No, 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 no. <laughs> she need that revenue very strong because if she didn't need it, she didn't have to come back. She wouldn't have even asked or been at the table talking about, come back. I'm going to pay you X amount of dollars. Nah. Okay. If she was doing well on her own, trying to be a real actress out there in the acting community, she would have did it. But she knew she could. She knew her limits and she knew her best bet and her solid check would be back on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Okay. All right. Moving on. Um, It says number five and is the last one. She's a published author, okay? The mother of two released her first book, Never Make the Same Mistake Twice, Lessons on Love and Life Learned the Hard Way in 2009. The memoir charts Leek's successful journey and painful childhood, okay? All right, so those are the five ways Nene has successful, successfully have been uh, lucrative and she hadn't made the five forwards list. I think Candy Birds would probably make it faster 
then she will. But that's just my my pun intended. Uh, but it just is what it is. Those were her five phases of how she gets down in the community to solidify her wealth, her empire for her and her family. Uh, that's cool beans. We're gonna move off this video onto another video. And uh, y'all tell me, y'all get down in them comments, definitely express your opinion. Don't be scared to interact with uh, other people in the comment section. They love it too, or they wouldn't be down there voicing their opinions. So interact, interact, interact. And while you're interacting, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Tell people about my channel if you haven't already done so. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please think about it. And go on and do it, okay? Because who else gonna bring you back to back, back to back videos on your face? For the Real Housewives of Atlanta, and I am test piloting Merit to Medicine as well. So, okay, get me to that ten thousand mark, okay? I really would appreciate it. Subscribe, 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 and let's throw the haters away, okay? Because I got some naysayers saying I can't do this thing, and y'all should know by now, I am not a one to be challenged and toyed with. I will get there, and it will be in June 2020, and if for some reason it's not, I'm sure that I'll be very close to it, okay, so let's silence the haters, let's get me 10,000 before June 2020, okay, because once you set your mind to it, ain't no stopping me now, I'm on move, yes, I really, really love you, Ain't no stopping me now. I've got the groove. Hey, hey, hey. I know you know someone that has a negative vibe. I'm going to stop there. Y'all know I'm going to continue, but not tonight. Okay, I got another video to break out, but y'all keep on trucking. When people say you can't do nothing, take their uh, attitude and how you voice it in your mind or how they say it and prove those itches wrong, okay? Get yours. Get yours and then get yours, okay? And let the haters fall back. Let the haters fall back because you're looking forward while they're in the back of you, okay? You ain't got no reason to look back because you pushing forward. Baby, take that as a wisdom golden nugget and rock with it all right see you next video and remember to subscribe 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 good night